From News 5, here's your Power of 5 weather and today's top stories. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. I am Mark J. Weather, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and TikTok. Almost the weekend here. We get showers overnight tonight, a brief shower during the morning hours. It's going to be a little cooler along the lakeshore with a lake breeze coming our way. But inland areas tomorrow afternoon should be dry with highs near 60. Another round of potentially heavy rain arrives Friday night into Saturday morning. Isolated showers Saturday afternoon. There you go. Heavy rain there, maybe some thunder. So it's a wet Saturday, but it will be mild. Scattered showers overnight, mostly cloudy tomorrow afternoon after a brief morning shower. We'll start off Friday morning in the 40s. Notice inland areas get up close to 60, but we are stuck in the 40s to near 50 lakesides. Keep that in mind. Cooler near Lake Erie. We'll go 49 for Cleveland, but Akron, Canton, you're going to get 59, 60, 61 degrees for you. Here you go. Seven days, Saturday, 62. Warm everywhere, but rain on and off could be heavy. Sunday, a few showers early, uh, a morning high of 59. Temps falling through the day. Rob? Mark, here's a look at today's top stories. The numbers are astounding. Nearly 188,000 Ohioans applied for unemployment just last week. To put that into perspective, around 369,000 people filed jobless claims all of last year. Again, there were more than half that many just last week. State leaders say they realize how frustrating it is to have those uh, had, having uh, trouble to get through to unemployment, either by the phone or online, but they're asking for patience now. Governor DeWine says he's giving courts more flexibility to decide which cases need to be heard immediately and which ones can wait. Courts now have until July 30th to try both civil and criminal cases. That gives them discretion to hold off on certain cases like evictions while still trying other more time-sensitive ones. Cleveland-based Love for the Elderly is asking people to write letters of love to lift the spirits of the elderly during this crisis. Many of them are isolated right now for their own safety. A few guidelines you have to follow. We have them posted for you right now on our News 5 app, as well as the address where you can send those letters. For the latest news and weather, go to news5cleveland.com or open the News 5 app. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.